it's kind of late tonight, but um, I decided to go ahead and drop this video. It's a Thursday, the 25th at 11 o'clock at night. Man, today was a good day. First, I'd just like to thank my um, core subscribers, my community. It's, uh, man, we about to hit 2K. So I really appreciate everybody liking, commenting, subscribing. Today on my on, on the journey, this was a very interesting journey. It's really three parts to this journey today, but I'm just gonna discuss one. So tonight, when I was with Q1 at the NFL draft party, I took some little index cards with me because I wanted Q to write down a goal. Q1 to write down a goal. While we was there, there was a couple that was beside us. They were from Philadelphia. And, uh, you know, they was, him and Q kind of had a, you know, conversation going about the draft. Y'all know me. I don't know nothing about football. I just be acting. I know a little bit about football, you know, but when it comes to all the players, um, strategies, stuff like that, I don't know nothing. Q1, he knows all of it. And um, I had Q1 write down a goal. I said, Q, man, you got to write down a goal. So that's one of the parts of this. But I had brought uh, a couple index cards with me. Because in this case, you know, he messed up writing. Had some extra index cards. So Q1 wrote down his goal. He was excited. I could tell he was nervous about writing it down too. But he wrote it down. Then I had like three or four index cards left. So I looked at the couple and I said, you know, y'all should write down a goal. And um, they was like, yeah, we should write down a goal, man. This is exciting and everything. So I'm thinking a small goal, you know, something just, you know, something, you know, a small goal, nothing major, nothing big, just a small goal. So she wrote down her, so she wrote down her goal first. And her goal was to look at her credit card statements every day. So, you know, they're a couple, so he was excited about that. He was like, yeah, that's a good goal and everything. So Q wrote down his goal. She wrote down her goal. So we waiting on him. So he over there thinking. I'm like, bro, you letting the pen get cold. I'm like, you letting the pen get cold. You know. He was like, yeah, so the draft is going on. I'm not trying to um, take away from the draft thing. But. You know, I did want him to write down a goal. So I explained to him, when you write down a goal, you're 50% more chance to get it done. When you look at every day, 70. She wrote down hers. You know, uh, look at her credit card statements every day. You know, get a hold of it. You know how these credit cards, y'all know how the credit card go. So he, he, he wrote down his goal. And I'm going to show y'all what he wrote down because at first I wasn't going to take a picture. It didn't even cross my mind to take a picture. I had sat back down and then someone was like, man, you got to take a picture. So I just want to show y'all what this gentleman wrote down. So I um, took the picture and I emailed it to Life Squad Journey at gmail.com. 
But I just want to show y'all what this guy go, what he wrote down. Uh, can you see it, y'all? Man, I knew this was gonna mess it up, but uh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Pick out a waiting venue by August. That was his goal was. His goal was pick out a wedding venue by August. Man, when she looked at it, she said, oh my. She said, oh my. Like, she was, she, she it, 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 I was like, what? He was like, man, yeah. He said, yeah, I need to pick, go ahead and pick it out. I've been, and I was like, man, that's deep, man. That's deep. And y'all know me, I got all the receipts. Q1 was right there. He seen it. His goal was to pick out a wedding venue by August. So, I so I didn't stay. They, uh, I left because I'm I'm tired. It's been a long day. But I told him if he pick it out by um you know pick it out, let me know. She said, well, we going to get married in Philly. They Philly fans, you know, Philly stuff on. So I was like, look, pick out. If you if you invite me, I'm not going to. I'm going to come to the wedding. I'm not going to stay long. But I definitely going to get get a little, couple of drinks on because, you know. And man, leaving tonight. Um, She, she really thanked me. She was like. Man, thank you for so much. She said, and then I looked at him and I said, man, you on Life Squad Journey. Gave my name, told him about my YouTube channel. And then I just want to end this by saying this. Before you get your day started, you need to pee. R A Y. I don't care who you pray to or who you pray for. I say that wrong. I don't care who you pray for. I mean, who you pray to or what you pray for, but you got to pray. You got to make your bed and you got to drink some spring water. You got to write down your goal and you got to look at it every day. Let me say that one more time. The first thing you got to do in the morning is you got to pray. P-R-A-Y. I don't care who you pray to or what you pray for, but you got to pray. You got to make your bed. Sometimes you don't have to make your bed, but I do. That sets a small goal that you achieved already. And then you got to drink some spring water. It's essential for brain function. Write down a goal, look at it today, and down trend off your phone. This guy's goal was pick a wedding venue by August. Man, if that ain't deep, man, I don't, I don't know what to tell y'all because y'all is on life. <laughs> Quiet journey, man, and I got all the receipts. So I don't want to take up all y'all time, but there you go. Click out a goal and look at it every day.